Hey everyone. I have a 12 by 16 canvas and I'm going to try doing a waterfall pour again. Um, we did a strainer pour with um, some new blues that I had and I kind of want to visit that a little bit. So I'm going to use this size cup. And I think I'm going to lay some black down um, and pour over black today. So let's get that first and then I'll go over colors with you. So I pre-mix my black with Floetrol and water. And I like it a little thinner than my paints themselves, um, just for flowing purposes. Working with black is messy, <laughs> but the results are beautiful, so it's worth it, I guess. I'm going to film a bunch of um, paintings today. So we'll have enough to get us through till next Monday. Covered well enough. So we did quite a few paintings on our live last night. We did our drawing. Um, I'd like to say congratulations again to Kendra, Trina, and uh, Katrina Welch. No relation. <laughs> they got some awesome prizes last night. We'll be doing it again at 20,000, and we're going to start planning that right now because we're getting close again. So we totally will fly by 15 without any preparation. So watch for that. Okay. So I'm going to move this so you guys can watch me fill the cup. And I'll just lay this rag over that so it's not quite so messy for you to see. I think I'm going to spray my cup first, and of course I'm using silicone in my paint, so let me just squirt this. And that is the WD-40 silicone spray. Everything that I use is on my Amazon shop, and the links are below if you want to purchase products through my link. Um, we do earn a small commission because we are affiliates with Amazon. Amazon. Okay. So I think the last color I want out of the cup will be the white. And then I'm going to go ahead and follow that with silver. Alright, so here's what I want to do. I want to turn my cup this way and just layer the color on the side of the cup. And I'm going to go ahead and follow right in order. That was Soho Silver. This is Craft Smart Midnight Blue. I don't have a lot of this. This is Craft Smart Blue Ice Pearl. Most of these are metallics. Craft Smart Pewter. And yes, these are craft paints. As long as they're mixed the same way, they should work fine. Okay, I want to break that up just a little bit with a little bit of black. And then hit it again with white. And 
And then this is the Lucas Steel Blue. It's really pretty. Reminds me of faded denim. And just a touch of black. And I'm gonna go back with the silver. The Midnight Blue. The end of that one. The blue Ice Pearl. The Pewter. And the Black. So there's quite a bit of paint in this cup. And that's okay. To get the design we want, we have to have enough paint, so. Okay, let me move this messy thing out of the way. If you guys watch me all the time, you know I don't like messy stuff. I like my areas clean. It's not a good um, thing to have when you're painting <laughs> to try to be clean. But it's, I gave it an effort. Okay, so I'm pinching my cup right here. And I want to put this up. So we'll be seeing a lot of paint run off the end. If I can get it over here, it's sticking. Okay. Here we go. Okay. So I'm just going to slowly make some small circles is all. Okay, it's going a little too fast, so we'll bring it back down a little. I'm not going for wings. The wing paintings are absolutely gorgeous, but uh, that's not what I'm going for. I like this 3D effect that you get. Okay, making sure I don't go over. Go ahead and pop the air bubbles. Just quite a few. And we'll probably get some cells. And it's right on the edge. <laughs> Just waiting to go over. What I want to do is bring this back a little bit and let this side go over first. stretch a little bit each way. I probably should bring my paint back to the middle. Let's do that first. I'm going to bring it back down. Okay. Yeah, we'll go that way first. I'm trying to create some paintings that I can put a resin coating on to show the depth of a ring pour. So always let your paint catch up with each other in the middle so you don't have any um, zigzaggy lines or wavy lines. And I will be taking these over the edge. I'm just working it um, to see what I want to keep and what I want to get rid of. And that side did go over a little bit, so we'll go ahead and take it over on the other side, too. And I'm watching the monitor to see if you can see everything. My um, son was just out here delivering me packages. <laughs> and some of my orders came in today, so I was a little excited. 
But the rest of them I have to wait until the day after the 4th, so. Okay. So I think what I'm going to get rid of is I'm going to try to bring it over both corners because I kind of like this separation here. Even though I love this here, I'm going to have to sacrifice something. I can't leave that much paint on the canvas, so let's see if we got all our paint down there. We do. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and start cupping because I don't want to lose um, a ton off. I'll cup it until I get where I want to be and then I'll let go. And we're going to do the same thing on this side. So it's kind of boring to me. So what I think I want to do is go ahead and bring it right over off this corner because I don't want to lose this white that I have. So I'm going to go ahead and get my hand down here in this corner. And if you're yelling, I'm sorry. <laughs> this is too plain for me. bring all that paint back up to the middle there. And then we're going to bring this corner down as well because I'm kind of liking it stretched out. slow now. So I'm kind of loving that right now. Wipe my hands off and we'll give it a torch. If I sound tired, it's because I am. We were up late with our live again. And I always watch it afterwards, so that was another two hours I was awake after that. I didn't go to bed till after two, so... And then I got up this morning and had to work, so <laughs> but my shift was over at noon. Okay, let me torch that. I could have put gold in here too, it would have made a big difference, but I didn't. I have that silver. That's it. I don't think we're going to get anything else. So let me give you a close-up. It's pretty cool. And I'll bring you over here and show you the white. So there she is. I think I'm liking where she's setting right now. I'm not going to change too much. So subscribe if you haven't already. Click the little bell next to the subscribe button and you'll be notified when I upload my next video. Click like and share and leave a comment. Uh, join me on Facebook at Christina Welch Art. Um, also, our Etsy shop is running a sale. 40% off all the paintings and 30% off all the jewelry. Shop with me on Amazon to get all your painting supplies, and you can shop for other stuff too through my link. And if you want to sponsor our channel to get in on the next giveaway, 
Uh, the PayPal link is below. Or you can email me at christinawelchart at yahoo.com for more information. Thanks so much for joining me today, and I will see you all on the next one. Bye now.